بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ہیلو آل مائی فرینڈس ویلکم ٹو مائی آفٹر فیکس ٹیٹوریل ان ٹوڈیز ٹیٹوریل آئی لائک ٹو کریٹ اے کول لکنگ لائٹ اسٹریک ان سائڈ آفٹر فیکس یوزنگ دا پاور فل پلگ ان ٹرپ کوڈ پرٹیکولر اوکے لیٹس سی واٹ وی آر کریٹنگ ان دس ٹیٹوریل Awesome. You can use that on your commercial, on your logo intro, or other things. Okay. Hope to enjoy the tutorial and give a fewness of your time to do that. Okay, let's create that from scratch. Okay, now let's create a new composition. Go to the composition menu and new composition. The first thing it's better to name this comps this is my main comp and um, from the preset you can choose a preset which one you like but I think for me the HDTV 1080 is better which is equal with the width of 1920 pixel and the height 1080 the frame rate is 29.97 and the duration is 10 seconds long. The background color doesn't matter but to be a little bit easy I think the black color is better. Hit OK and OK that. Now let's create a new light because I'm going to create and emit the particles from a specific point which is the light so in this case it's better to create new light one thing that's very important to name this light as emitter and let's change the light type from spot to point the color and intensity is doesn't matter for now in later I'm going to enhance that a little bit click OK now let's create a simple animation hit the P key on your keyboard to show up the position now hit the stopwatch about 10 or 20 per I think from the from start to up to two second I would like to go the light here there in a little bit to be out of the camera let's see that from the top okay that's more I think and that should be there it should has a little bit of anger I don't like to go that straight and up to four seconds should go there now let's a little bit enhance that should go there and go to the active camera that should be a little bit I think down In the position of the Z value should be a little bit that should be a little bit close to this side. And from the four second up to five second, I think that's better to go up to six second. I should go back to that side. But these all things just belong to you. If you like a simple animation, you like advancing complex animation, that doesn't matter. It's just belong to your desire. And here 
here that should be a little bit like this. Perfect. We can just enhance that a little bit later and just create a streak. Let's create a new layer for Chapcode particular. Go to the layer, new, and new solid. This is my particular, particular. And make that comp size, and I'll think it's just perfect, the same, and hit OK. Now you can find the effects at the right upper side there. You can search here, particular. This is trap code particular. Or you can go to the effect menu, trap code, and particular. When you just create the first time, the particle is just emitting from one point. So what I want now, I just want to say particular that please follow the light I just created, which is this mirror light. Okay, let's first change a mirror type from point to light because I am telling particular to emit the particles from that light. Now you can play that exactly. Okay, perfect. Now let's change the particle per second from 100 to I think 250. Zero zero two thousand five hundred. Okay, let's change the velocity to zero, velocity random to zero, 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 and zero. All of these parameters should be zero because I would like to create a striped line. Let's go to particle. Change the lapse per second to 2.3 for now. And change the particle type from sphere to streaklet. Now you can see this is the shape. This is a streaklet shape. Change the size to 30. And let's uh, change the set color from at start to from light. What I just told the particular, I told him that please take the color from this light, this white light. Now let's change the blending mode from normal to add. But you can see there is nothing to appear. This is a fully white color. Now when I just go back to mirror you can just change the color there to an orangish color or should be dark and change the intensity from 100 to 35 and hit OK. Now this is my light. OK. Now Go to the size and change that a little bit. How does this appear? I think the theory is enough. And opacity to be 90. And go to the streak lit and change that from no streak. And the streak size should be 20. Yeah, that's great. Now let's change a little bit the size to from 32 to a pipe. Yeah, that's the thing that I want. That's my desirable. Now let's jump from particle to arc system. I just now would like to add a little bit of trial there. Okay, let's change that from up to continuously. And let's uh, change the lab. Uh, I think that's enough. 
and the size should be 3 change the color or limit from this color to a poly white color change a little bit of the black per second to 1 and now let's change from normal to add now let's jump to physics and change the turbulence position a little bit okay like this perfect I think there is nothing to be changed other I think the light is perfect and animation is perfect for me yeah that's better okay now let's change a little bit up the second trail change the size or lap from this pool color to this preset and clip that yeah that's perfect and change a little bit of turbulence be from 80 to 100 Okay, now let's create a lens for this tricklet. Let's create a new solid. Right click here and create a new solid. And this is my lens. And make that cam size. Okay. Good effects. Video copilot and optical layers. This is the light. Now you can just change the type of the lights from the position okay now go to the preset browser you can see all of the lens types and which one is perfect yeah this one the iron mosaic is perfect hit ok and ok now I would like to track this lens player to the light that is emitting and creating the streak what should I do let's change the source tab from 2d to track lights now what is it just doing it's just tracking the light that was an emitter light let's change the render mode from on black to on transparent now what should I see can see the lens okay let's enhance and make the scale or brightness yeah that's better okay now let's duplicate this the emitter one thing in particular that's very drastic and incredible when you just duplicate the emitter, it's just automatically duplicating the particles. Okay, go to edit, duplicate, or the shortcut is control D. Now let's change a little bit of the animation. Transform, this is light position. like this now you can see there is two light that is meeting and from there they should be you should just separate the way Perfect.
Okay. Now let's change the color of this light. Go to layer, light setting, and change the color to a red or a green color. That should be a little bit dark. That's perfect. You can just enhance more than this. I should just a little bit decrease the intensity or the brightness of the lens player. And you can just duplicate that more times. For example, you can just duplicate this one. That should at this time go sorry from there that should be a little bit separated the way and at the end that should go to this side sorry and change the color of this one by Clicking Control Shift and Y. Change the light type to red color. You can just preview that. Press the zero key on your numlock keys. You can duplicate it more times and you can enhance a little bit up the size or you can enhance the, the particle you can do more better than this one hit again the zero key you can see awesome this is cool looking better and you can see that the animation is too slow you can just make that very fast and you can just add a text there light streak can change the color to greenish color okay hope to enjoy the tutorial or oh, hope to get a sense of understanding I'm so glad that I just created the tutorial one thing that this was my first tutorial uh, sorry if there was any tagging mistakes or, or other things so hope to enjoy the tutorial see you in next tutorial